Yamaha has once again taken marine technology to the next level with the industry first and game changing Yamaha Hellmaster EX boat control system. Hellmaster EX is a world first. That means it's the first single outboard application for a fully integrated control system. It makes navigating and getting to your destination easier and once you arrive, gives a whole new level of control to precisely maneuver your craft to exactly where and how you want it. One of the main advantages about Hellmaster EX is it allows you to lock on to a GPS position and go hands free. Whether you're a beginner or seasoned expert, Hellmaster EX guarantees to make your fishing and boating experience easier, more enjoyable and productive. So whether you're in a current or the wind's blowing a gale, it'll hold you in that position and keep you on the fish for longer. Another great feature is Drift Point, and Drift Point allows you to maintain the orientation of your vessel while you travel down a predetermined set path. This is great for drifting down reef structure or targeting a specific area which you know will hold fish. We invited our Yamaha dealers for some on-water testing today and this is what some of them thought about it. The new release of the Hellmaster EX, absolutely incredible. Um, obviously at a bigger end market, more of the launch market that um, the money is disappearing into as we go. America's Cup coming, ideal time to release something as fantastic as this. Couldn't get over the control, the slow speed control, uh, something I've never seen before. Remembering 60 odd years in the industry, we started off with rope around a pulley. <laughs> a lot of development, a lot of development, in the, especially as far as Yamaha is concerned. Absolutely brilliant. I was uh, impressed because I've seen the older system and looking at the new system, I looked at it from the aspects of uh, usability and also installation, and I think it's a massive improvement. It looks like it's going to be a really easy to install, which will cut down costs, and it's really quiet and very uh, user-friendly. I think the main advantage personally for me for this system is uh, being to able to stay on the top of uh, fish schools or structure, so uh, anywhere from starting my day finding live baits, once I find a school of live bait, I don't have to be hanging on to the wheel and hanging on to the throttle, um, constantly trying to stay on spot. It's just a push of a button. I can spend more time out on deck with uh, customers or friends fishing, um, and I can just stay really still. The same when I move out to structure, I can stay straight over the top of fish without having to um, stay on the wheel and just keep working hard, basically, to keep the boat still. It's just the touch of a button and I can be uh, concentrating on everything else going on on the boat instead. I, I think the main advantage of the system is, is it gives you total control over the boat in all weather conditions. So you're not worried about coming into docks. It makes it easy to, even anyone can actually load the boat up close and so people can load on and off. It's, it gives you confidence behind the wheel of, of what's going on and where you're putting the boat, even if you're getting in close to a point for fishing, you're not worried about well, what's going to happen with the wind or the tide. It sits there and holds it for you beautifully. The best part of the system that I can see on air side of it is the, the way that it can control boat drift. If you've got a, a spot where you know you've got cod, in the South Island we've obviously got blue cod, to be able to put a point in and let the boat go in and out of gear, steer you back against tide and against wind movement and hold the vessel exactly where the fish are biting, magic. Uh, the one mode that I actually was impressed with was uh, bow mode or stern mode. You can actually chop and change between whether you want the stern held in a certain point or whether you wanted the bow held in a certain point. I took the call in 87 to go sole Yamaha, best thing I've ever done, and the, the development in my time of owning my business, if the same thing happens with Brad taking over over the next 30 years, incredible. <laughs>